Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Gordon over here. It's Gordon here in the gym, as always, you know, putting in some work. And um, today I want to share with you guys a really awesome idea that's uh, enabled me to you know, be a little bit more free in my life and to, and, and to feel better, to think better, to you know, experience life on a higher level. And it's a really, really simple idea. You know, life is very yin and yang. You know, you have you know the light, you have the dark, you have the the good times, the bad times, the ups and the downs. And one thing that that pattern reoccurs in as well is the dynamic of charging up and discharging. You know, I found that the more I charge up, the more I'm able to express, the more I'm able to release. But in society, it's just hard sometimes for us to find the best source of energy to charge up from. And so that's what I've been experimenting with and, and, and learning, uh, you know, over the last, you know, five, six, seven months, year, two, three, four years, all my life, right? Finding different ways to charge up. And so I'm just gonna share with you guys a few simple ways that you can charge up today and to, you know, to elevate your mind, to elevate how you feel, to elevate your energy. Um, you know, really, really simple methods you can use that you probably don't even think about and you take for granted, but when you think back in your life, you'll see that, holy crap, that does charge me up. So the first way to charge yourself up is through your breath. Breath is an incredible way to charge yourself up with energy so that your mind is elevated, so your mood is elevated. You'll often notice that your emotion is always very closely linked with your breath. And so one thing I do every single day that gets me charged up and ready is when I hit the gym and I'm starting to breathe heavy, well now I'm taking in more breaths per minute. I'm taking in more oxygen per minute. And so when you go to the gym during the day and you charge up on your breath like that, it increases the tone for the rest of your day for you to be taking in more oxygen and, and energy and prana through the air that charges you up in many, 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 many ways. So the breath is number one. If I were you, I would find a book dealing with the breath and learning how powerful and how much you know beauty you can draw from the simple art of breathing. Number two is through light, right? Spend time outdoors. You charge up from the sun. The sun is the obviously a, a, a source of energy, a source that we can all go to to charge up on energy. So simply put, spend more time from natural, you know, get more, spend more time in natural light versus artificial light from the TV, going in and riding your pineal gland. Look into the sun, look into somebody else's eyes. You know, other people have light within them too. So find different ways to charge up from light. Third, obviously, food. Go out and eat some, you know, good foods that are going to charge you. Some foods are going to, you know, discharge you. Some foods are going to do the opposite of charge you and weigh you down. So, you know, just be wise with your food choices. I ain't gonna get too deep into that. And then, um, you know, the fourth thing that kind of, it's, it's different, but the fourth thing that I, I, I'd say is charge up on growing pains. What do I mean by that? You know, I, I have found in life that when I put myself in uncomfortable situations, like lifting weights and, and repetitions and pushing weight, and, it, and it's challenging me, and I'm, I'm, I'm experiencing that, my nervous system is experiencing the sensation of burning and pain. My nervous system is being charged up on these pains, on these growing pains, and my brain is being charged up on fighting or, um, you know, you know, redirecting my thoughts. You know, pain and pleasure. Pain is placed in your life for a reason. You know, and instead of running for it, you know, I think you should move into it. Move into the things that pain you, because you'll find that that pain can be converted into energy that will charge you up if you just overcome it. And you, and you look it in his face and, and you, you, know, you grow with that pain. You know, so one thing I do, I put myself through pain every single day. You know, I put myself in uncomfortable situations that often make me afraid. You know, fear is a form of pain. Doubt is a form of pain. And I put myself in situations that make me feel fear and doubt every single day. But one of my favorite ways uh, to experience that pain in my nervous system that elevates my, you know, that charges me up and stimulates me. You know, that's another great word for charging up, stimulation. But another thing I'll do is I'll take cold showers. I'll take freezing cold showers every single day. And when I do that, 
my nervous system, when that cold water shocks my skin and my muscular system, my nervous system, I can just imagine in the seat, my nervous system lighting up from all the sensation and all the, you know, the stimulation that's happening from this freezing cold water. So, you know, I'll put myself through pain in that way and I find that it, it increases my mental clarity, it increases my ability to communicate, and I just feel better. But this is all my experience, you know, so I just want to share with you guys um, some simple ways that you can charge up today because, you know, if, if you want to be able to express and to give your spirit and to, and to if, you know, enjoy this life to the fullest, you got to be charged up on some energy. Think of a few people in that we all look up to, like, you know, The Rock or, or, or Kevin Hart or, um, you know, like any of your favorite sports players, LeBron or, you know, whoever that you look up to, you'll often find they're charged up with a certain kind of energy. So, what is it in your life that you, you know, you find pleasure from and that, that stimulates you and charges you up? Get charged up. It'll change the game for you. Much love, y'all. Hope you enjoyed this video.